Welcome back to Patricia Stewart Originals. And today, I was trying to organize some of my gel prints. I have so many gel prints. And what I did was I took a regular folder, two pocket folder, and I ran a piece of elastic down through it and tied it. And I have some gel prints here that I haven't used yet. So I folded them in half and just slid them through the elastic to hold it. I have some other bigger sheets of um, glassine, so I folded those and put it in the pocket. And here are other pieces left over that I've used in my board books and other projects. And so I put them in this pocket. And so this is very easy and economical. These folders, I must have got 10 for a dollar someplace. And you can organize your prints by color or by paper or however you want to arrange it. And this way it makes it easier for me so when I'm ready to add some things to my board book, I'm looking at whatever colors I want to add and I can just go through my pages here easily and see which ones I may want to use. And so it's very quick to do. If you don't have elastic, you can certainly use yarn. You run a piece of yarn and tie it really snug to the back in a knot. And then you can slip your papers, fold them in half, and uh, slip them through very easily. You can use embroidery thread, like all six strands that come together, tie it across, knot it in the back. The same thing, any cord or thin cord or rope that you have, it will do the same thing. But it's a good way to organize your prints. Originally, I had some prints um, in folders like these that I made and I put orange turquoise family, uh, two sheets of uh, computer paper stapled together and I just put some masking tape so my fingers wouldn't uh, cut on the staples. And inside I have those colors in the folder and so that's an option as well. These are pieces that have been used. I've also used these when I work with children, when I do collage work with children. Each of them uh, get a folder with all the pieces for the collage project. And it makes it easier for them to sit and do their work. Um, and so I have, you know, lots of leftover pieces from those classes. So I have several envelopes like this. But after a while, I kind of got tired of pulling out all of them and sorting through. So uh, this here is even easier because I open the folder and it's all staring at me and I can sort through, I can go through these, I can look at the pieces that I have uh, that I may want to use to add to my board books or uh, some other type of uh, uh, journaling. I had this rice paper in one, and I said, okay, I'm going to use this to cover my book. And so um, if the papers are out where you can, you know, see them quickly, more readily, and still feel like you've organized your prints. Uh, so this is a quickie, grab a quick quickie tip. Um, about gel prints. Thanks for stopping by.